Um, I, I would definitely recommend it. And actually, I, that's a very good point. I should have put it in my paper or in my talk. Yes? Just a comment from the peanut gallery. My personal um, uh, pet peeve on the giving up the moral high ground is when advocates for freedom preface their remarks by saying, well, communism is great in theory. Yeah. Yes. Uh, that, um, and that's really the same thing. That's great in theory. Now, that, that also depends on the uh, dichotomy between theory and practice, uh, which is often involved in this kind of situation of the moral high ground. But, but yeah, all those people say, you know, socialism is noble, but capitalism is practical. Or, you know, I forget who it was who said, um, any, I think it was Winston Churchill, actually. Someone who was not a socialist in his youth uh, is what, a knave. Anyone who is a socialist in his old age is a fool. Something like that, it's not exact. But the point is, it's noble. It just a moral word. No, it's not noble. It's not noble. It's a system of enslavement. That's what communism is about. That's the point of it. Don't give them that argument. So, that excellent example. Yes? One thing you said that really stuck, stuck a resonant chord with me was never deal a moral high ground. I wish I had an application <laughs> in my phone that would tap me on the shoulder every time I did that so I could learn not to do that. Mm -hmm. Because it's something one has to learn to do. That, yes. that really struck a chord. Well, thank you. And um, I think it'd be cool to have a couple of philosophical apps, you know, that we could all download. Some would probably make a, a bundle. <laughs> Unfortunately, we don't know enough about the great ones, I think, yet. Yeah.